I still remember my grandma, whenever we had uh, small cuts or burns, she would apply turmeric paste to it. It was like a quick household antiseptic cream. But let me tell you, my mom never believed in that because she felt, what if the turmeric was not pure? If there was some mixture of other spices, hmm, that wound is really going to hurt. So this was all my old grandma's theory of applying turmeric paste to wounds and burns. But turmeric is also said to help in digesting particularly high protein foods like uh, beans and lentils and meat. So all the recipes which have, um, tum uh, which have beans in them will always call for turmeric. Well, the other part is the beans are quite bland looking and the yellow color makes it more cheerful. For example, here I have this recipe which has split yellow mung beans. Now I've cooked them and let me show you a simple recipe which ca you can use for a variety of things. I use the stuffing for uh, my samosas, sometimes to make a burrito. And this is an interesting appetizer that I've come up with. So, let me show you the recipe. I use about a teaspoon of oil. Then add some cumin seeds to it. Wait till you hear a little bit of sizzling and also a little bit of brown coloring of the cumin seeds. Once you see that, then you add the red chilies. These are dried red chilies. Now this red chili is purely optional. If you don't want it, you can skip it. And the magic yellow powder, turmeric. This burns very easily, so you have to be really quick. some salt, lime juice, and the option of maybe if you want you can add cilantro, it just gives more flavor. and quick recipe. This can be enjoyed with plain rice. You need to add a little bit of water if you're planning to add have it with some rice. But what I would like to do is serve it as an appetizer. For this I'm going to take some red cherry tomatoes, scoop out its pulp, Then I take a slice of cucumber and I've just made little wedges in here so that it gives a little flower like shape. And then I'm just going to add it here. And finally, add a scoopful of this dough into here. Very simple, very easy to make, at the same time very nutritious. Now if you were to make this recipe without the turmeric, let me tell you, it'll look very dull.
So here you have a very simple recipe with yellow ye split mung beans and uh, it has been cooked with just two or three spices. It's got cumin seeds, red chili and of course the famous yellow powder turmeric. 